What would you ask for more of? This PG thirteen, isn't it? More lines <laughs> in, in this. <laughs> A bigger part. Chips. Manchego. More peace. Nothing. I've got enough. More height. I'm very short. Bigger boobs. Oh, okay. Well, there you go. <laughs> Me too. Describe Oliver Twist in ten words or less. Orpho. Mm -hmm. Hungry. For love. Good. Nice. And food. Yes, for sure. Little lad. Imagine an inspiring story about a young man or a child figuring out their way in the world without their mother's love, but also with their mother's love. I think that's 10 words or less. It was 25, did you count? <laughs> oh my God. If your character, Bill Sykes, found themselves in modern day London, what would they do first? Go on the roads. If you understand, you understand. He loves to sort of be the superior and like, you know, rank. You know, and I think that he'd probably be one of those sort of internet trolls. You know, like when you go to Uniqlo and you put, you have to put all your things in the thing and it scans all of it, he'd just walk straight out. So I think he'd be, um, he'd just be shoplifting basically, wouldn't he? He's quite macabre. Mm. He likes, he likes, I think he'd go to the London dungeon actually. Yeah. I think he'd do one of those all day experiences and. Yeah, sort of Chamber of Horrors in Madame to Swords. What would you find most difficult about living in Victorian London? Well, I presume I'd be uh, living in poverty. I wouldn't be, you know, I'd be below stairs. Probably the smell of raw fish. Urine and horse dung. Everyone is so smelly and, yeah, stinky. Everyone looks like a chimney sweep. There's, like, nothing's ever clean, so... I quite like, like, white T-shirts and that, and I think it would be a bit of a nightmare. Dickens had a pet raven. What bird would suit you best as a companion? An emperor penguin called Conchita. No one will mess with you if you have an emperor penguin called Conchita. I wonder what his name was, the pet raven. Which character in Oliver Twist would you befriend if you had to? Oh, Dodger. Yeah, I, I, I would I, too. Yeah, I feel Dodger would get you out of scrapes. Awful Dodger survive, kind of laugh. That's my guy. I would pick Nancy because she's uh, she's streetwise, and I play Rose, who isn't. I think possibly Fagan, actually. Certainly not Sykes. I feel like Nancy's a good person to have a fr as a friend. She seems like she'd be nice to you, and even on a Sunday morning when you are feeling hungover or whatever, she'd probably make you a fry up. The Victorians have just invented a full English breakfast. I didn't know that. And a Victoria sponge cake. Which one do you try first? Sponge cake. Victoria sponge cake. The full English breakfast first, and then I'd have the cake. Mm, I'd sort go for the cake. Savoury foot. And the cake. But you can't have a sponge cake for, for full English. That's, that'd be weird, isn't it? Victoria sponge cake, next. What's your favourite thing about recording audio? I can do it in my pants, and you'll never know. <laughs> <laughs>